My name's Eric Bradshaw, and I'm a professional photographer. The shoot came together by virtue of the fact that we just simply wanted to put together a high fashion editorial spread that we're going to shotgun out to various international fashion publications. The team for the photo shoot today consists primarily of Catherine Van Zant for our model. We have Kim Williams doing hair. Stephen Sean is on makeup. Mike Kay is photo support today. Um, the wardrobe design was provided to us by Ellen Berlin. And we have custom jewelry design by Lella Foster Designs. Um, and we have our beautiful location provided to us by Neil Stevenson of Neil Stevenson's Architects. One of our favorite outfits for the day of the shoot was a long red dress. And when we were looking at the various location opportunities out there, we came across a rooftop and we decided that that would be the optimal place with the sunlight coming behind her. We had some smoke drifting by and it just presented a perfect opportunity despite the wind that we had to deal with that day. That particular shot with the long red dress was done with sunlight coming for backlight and we used uh, an assistant to bounce with a very large six foot by six foot reflector. My name is Katherine Van Zandt. We've done about two looks so far and we are in this fabulous space. I believe we're doing a white sleeveless blouse with some ruffles and black pants. The next shot involves shooting the model through an industrial window and the interesting part of this was that no one else in the team thought that this image would work given how dirty the windows were and the reflections and whatnot, but they actually turned out to be my personal favorites of the shoot.
everything in this series was done with either natural light or natural light with the accompaniment of a reflector. Up until this point in the shoot, we had not used any strokes. The next shot involved a red dress with aggressive styling on the hair and the makeup, and we lit it by using a red gel strobe behind her on her right, camera left, and filling with a strobe bouncing at the ceiling. wanted with the aggressive eye makeup that we had in place at the time to do a fairly interesting portrait and it just simply involved our model putting on makeup in a bathroom in front of the mirror. It was done all with the natural light that was already in the master bathroom. We had the most fun with our very last shot of the day, which involved using three fans to suspend papers floating around our model. We stroked her from either side and we had an absolute blast shooting this particular one. One of the secrets to being a good photographer, in my opinion, is to have an incredible team that you have in your corner with you. And I have the absolute best team in the world. And I want to send out a very sincere thank you to them for everything that they do for me. The more professionals you're able to have on your team, the better the work quality is going to be, the higher level you can take your work. There's several of you that might feel that you wouldn't be able to get this kind of a team in place, but you'd be amazed at how many artists are out there that would be very eager to be a part of your photo shoot and all you have to do is ask them. Can we get Jackie Chan to dub over me? Ni switching hobble hall, boo doll.